Hello, my name's Deb Stokes and I'm a teacher. Uh, I came to live in Alfred Cove uh, four years ago now, nearly five, uh, because I was looking for an excellent school for my son and uh, found Applecross Senior High School and wanted to live in the area, in the catchment area for him and um, make sure that he was well supported with community resources. I'm an avid reader um, and so I use the library a great deal as does he um, and we, um, we're very appreciative of the fact that it's such a good uh, community resource um, and that's a good thing. Not only is, uh, as a teacher, education is important to me in terms of of young people and children, but education on a much broader scale is important too. Um, so community education, adult education, and having those facilities in the community really matters to me. Um, I have lots of associations with various museums, uh, and uh, for me, those museums, the art gallery, the Libraries are all part of the culture and the fabric, the social fabric of our society um, and uh, an absolutely vital part of our community and I think in Melville we're really well served with that. Uh, so that was one of the great attractions for moving here. I, I'm lucky enough to have a four-year-old granddaughter uh, who likes lots of physical activity and so we go out to the many parks that are around the area uh, and there's you don't have to go to the same one twice so the kids don't get fed up with it. And it's just, it's fun. There's always something to do. I think one of the great things that um, Melville Talks is giving people the opportunity to do is to have that conversation about the Civic Centre uh, and having a more visible Civic Centre. And I know there are great plans afoot for this area and for uh, Garden City. Um, and to have that in a more cohesive and obvious fashion will be great. Sometimes some of the, the best things about Melville are almost like secrets that you have to find out about. Uh, so uh, I think that conversation about accessibility and having, um, and having people uh, be able to see in a more visible way, um, to see you know, a centre for the community is one of the conversations I'd like to be part of. Yeah.